Hey guys, so I've got to be at my hair appointment in 20 minutes. Not leaving, I've got to be there in 20 minutes. And I just woke up. So without hesitation, let's go. Okay, I'm feeling a little lost. I don't know what to do. I have like 18 minutes before I'm supposed to be there. I'm not gonna have time to have a shower. Um, I just, I... <sighs> We're having weed a bit. I don't have any cans of iced coffee, which I can just grab and take, which is great. I also have a dribble of milk in there, which... Uh, you know what, fuck off. I need to leave in like four minutes. I'm not sure if this is gonna be like a whole glow up video. Hopefully it will, that'd be nice. <laughs> I've actually been awake for seven minutes now. No coffee, no nothing. I'm gonna get my clothes on and whilst you're here, subscribe if you haven't already. I'm Chloe if new here, didn't say that before. And of course go follow my socials, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Snap. Okay, uh, perfume, so I don't smell because I've not had a fucking shower. I don't actually tend to smell. I don't and I know that I don't because usually like I'll ask other people and they say that I don't which is good. I mean if I don't have time for a shower and I'll spray deodorant like I don't get smelly. I always have a shower. No I'm digging myself a hole. Ow. I also want more. Ow! That literally didn't hurt. Right what are we doing? I've got to leave like right now. Yes I do all the cooking. Let's go. Okay. I'm out of breath. I literally jogged to the car. I also finally got my car cleaned. Mm. It was actually kind of embarrassing. Like I had to go to a garage that was just full of men and lads. When I say like my car was awful, like I pulled up and the guy was like, oh, have you been through a field? And I was like, no, just not got it cleaned in five months. I wish I'd had some sort of coffee right now. Like I started getting um, these cans of iced coffee. It's called Jimmy's Iced Coffee. It's actually really good. On the road again. Why am I doing 38 out of 30? <laughs> if any police officers watch my videos, I say all of this purely for entertainment purposes. Oh shit, I was meant to go down there. Fucking hell! Am I going into a cemetery? What? Oh fuck me. Oh great, now I'm going through a graveyard. Oh, this is fucking depressing. Why am I driving through a graveyard like it's a fucking golf course? Oh god, we're in the thick of it now. Awful person. I'm using a graveyard as a shortcut. Okay, I'm here. Uh, also, when I left, I had to wipe a dribble crust off my face with my own spit. Love it. I'm so hungry. Have I even eaten today? Oh yeah, one crunchy Weetabix. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go get some food and I will see you when I'm doing my next glow up activity. I have no idea what that's gonna be yet. I'm just being a bit spontaneous. I act like I'm really crazy, I'm not. Okay, it's nail time. My mom's doing my nails. Mm. Yeah, so I'm gonna be getting really long, pointy, stiletto, bright red nails. That's what I'm getting. I've just had my toes done, but I'm not gonna show you my toes. Please, may I see the length, sir? You're like the, like the, the baths with the claw feet. You know what I mean. Oh my God, I don't like that. <laughs> I got my nails done, are you ready to see them? Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh wow, my toes look really good as well, but well, apart from my big toe that's like, <laughs> not doing too good. Okay, so I'm going to get my belly pierced today. I literally only decided that I wanted this doing like two weeks ago. And here we are. I'm at my mom's because my mommy is coming to film me have it done. Oh, and also change my septum piercing to... You'll have to wait and see. Okay, let's go. Are you ready, mom? No. Okay. <laughs> All that lighting's pissing me off. I'm ready to get my belly pierced. I should have removed my belly hair before I came. Not that there's anything <laughs> wrong with belly hair, but it's just not my vibe. Oh. Is it it? I'm well confused. Oh, oh, now it's in. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, wait, that didn't hurt. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just <laughs> going with the flow. Is it done? I love that. Wow. Hell yeah. I've just realized I completely forgot to even show my belly piercing in the rest of this video. So I'm gonna insert a few pickies here 
Um, and also, I got my septum changed to a spiky septum. Wow. I really want to try, I really want to try some what I'm not even going to try and speak. Right, fuck off. I'm so tired right now. I'm going to remove my moustache. I was in Selfridges before and I was buying a foundation and I was stood in front of one of like the vanity mirrors whilst the woman was like looking at my face and trying to match my shade. And I just saw this moustache. It was coming back and I was like, if I can see it, so can this woman. This is nothing new. We know Chloe has a moustache by now. We just gotta keep on top of it. Anyway, I'm actually so tired right now. Here we go. This lighting's well good. Okay. I was also gonna tint my brows right now, but I really don't know if I can be asked doing that. Right, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna whack it on quick. And then they're both gonna develop at the same time. Right, come on, Chloe. I'm gonna thoroughly wash my hands because if I get hair removal cream in my eyebrow, it's not gonna be a good day. Okay, I've got the I'm Your Dye Brow in black. I used dark brown last time. I don't know why I have black hair. Yes, can I get a can I get it for the in the house? Yeah. Cream, color cream, color creamy. Oh, I love it when you have to do that. Do you know when you have to pop it open? Yeah. Oh, I'm a savage. Mm. We mix until she goes into a nice creamy paste. But she's not, she's not doing so good. She's a bit more of a cream now. Awesome. So we just apply. Can you see that? Yeah. I vow that if we go into another lockdown, I am going to seriously maintain my appearance. I was not doing well in the first lockdown. It was like actually an awful time. Okay, nice. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna have to wipe this stuff off. Whoa, he's developing. I'm gonna have to wipe this moustache removal cream off now because the last time I did it I got a big fucking rash on my face. Woo! Time to wash. I am deflated. Oh my god, I actually think I'm about to drop to the floor. Let's brush our teeth whilst we're here. Oh! <laughs> I want to go on a trip by myself soon. It is much needed. Like, I only realised it the other day. I was like, holy shit. Like, I don't remember the last time I did something actually exciting. Like, that is what is missing from my life. I could talk for a long time about that. I could talk for a long time about most things. We know that by now. So, mm, should I? I think I've got some tin on my nail. No, not my perfect red nail. Oh, fuck it. But yeah, I just realized recently that lockdown has literally conditioned us into being so used to staying in that now that things are opening up again, I'm like not even, I've not been booking a load of things. I've not been going out and making the most of everything because I'm so used to doing nothing and being inside. Like I'm not looking for fun things to do because I'm so used to, it's like, it's made us become complacent with living a dull life and feeling dull. It's like lowering the vibration of humans. Not good, so we can't let that happen to us, all right? We're in this together, bitch. So I'm definitely gonna go and do something spontaneous, a nice, a, a cool trip somewhere in a nice setting where I'll probably vlog it still, but where I can just detach and escape and just be free with my soul and just read and make art and write poetry. I don't know why, but I've just, I've started fucking writing poetry recently. Not even like, just the other night, just poetry just started flowing through my head. I was like, hey, why the fuck don't I just write this down? I used to be an amazing writer. I used to read and write so much. Like, that was my main thing when I was in school, when I was like a kid. When I was a small child, I was so good at writing and reading. I was, I was such, such a good creative writer. And I just started writing poetry, just in my journal. I just wrote another one there whilst I was having a shit. But yeah, I want to go away for like four days or something and just break away from like the matrix and all boundaries that I feel like daily life has on me. I feel like when I'm living in this, like I've been stuck in this apartment for like a solid five months now in the four walls. I'm not even kidding. We went into lockdown as soon as I moved in. As soon as I moved in. And so you've not even seen a fucking apartment tour. Are you going to at this rate? Not too sure. It's just what's just... But yeah, I feel like living daily life and living sort of the same lifestyle day in, day out for so long. I don't know how to put it. You kind of limit yourself. You can get consumed in more like just irrelevant things in your head. 
and worry more about literally nothing. I don't know how to explain it, but you just do. And I feel like if I was to go on a trip where it's a completely different setting, there's no rules, there's no expectations that I have for my day because I'm so used to living the same thing. I'm in a completely different place. I can do whatever I want, but I'll still like work out and read and just, I think it'll be really good. And I encourage any of you that are old enough to go do that on your own and have the time to do it, or find the time to do it, go and do it, because I feel like it's gonna be really good for me. This usually never stains my skin, but because it's black, I really hope it doesn't. Because <laughs> that will be a hashtag epic fail. Wear cotton bud check. Let's just go for it, all right? Have I left it on for enough time? I don't even know. Why the fuck am I doing it with this? What the fuck is this gonna do? Let's just get a baby wipe. Oh wait, no, I know, just the thing. Wear cotton pad check. Oh god, oh don't tell me it's staining my skin. Just don't do that to me. Oh, oh wait, no, I think it's coming off, kind of. No, it's not. I, yeah, no, I lied. I love it when it looks like that. Well, this is gonna put my new foundation to the test and see if it covers it up. Stay tuned to see, I don't have the energy to be like that right now, I just don't. Okay, whatever. I guess I'll have to do. Hello everybody. This is another video without an outro. I don't actually know why. I don't know why I didn't do an outro. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. As you can see, I'm in a different environment. I'm at my dad's because I've already moved out of my apartment and those vlogs are gonna be up soon. So stick around, bitch. If you haven't already, go and follow my socials, subscribe, turn on post notifications, leave me a like and a comment on this video. Bye.